Here we have two intersecting lines AB and CD forming different pairs of angles. We know that they are equal. Let's go through the theorem and its proof. Theorem on vertically opposite angles. Statement of the theorem is if two lines intersect then the pairs of vertically opposite angles are equal. Let's see what is given here. Two lines AB and CD intersect at a point O. So this will be our point O where the lines are intersecting. We have to prove vertically opposite angles angle AOC and BOD are equal. That means this angle is equal to this angle and angle AOD is equal to angle BOC that means this angle is equal to this angle. Let's see the approach for proving this theorem. Let's take one pair of vertically opposite angles from here. Let's take the pair marked in green. If we take angle AOC from this pair then let's take its adjacent angle angle AOD which is marked in blue here. Let's identify the relation between angle AOC and angle AOD. Well, they form a linear pair. So angle AOC and angle AOD form a linear pair. Can we identify one more linear pair here which has one of these angles? Of course we can. Here angle AOD forms a linear pair with angle DOB, the one shown in brown here. So angle AOD and angle DOB also form a linear pair. So angle AOD and BOD also form a linear pair here. So this will imply since these two angles form a linear pair, their sum will be 180 degrees. So we can say angle AOC plus angle AOD is equal to 180 degrees. Call this as 1. Also, this implies that angle AOD and BOD, their sum will also be 180 degrees. So we can write angle AOD plus angle BOD is equal to 180 degrees. Call this as 2. From 1 and 2, we can see that RHSs are equal. So their LHSs will also be equal. So this implies angle AOC plus angle AOD is equal to angle AOD plus angle BOD. Now angle AOD is common on both sides so we can cancel this. So this will imply angle AOC is equal to angle BOD. So this is the first part of our theorem that angle AOC is equal to BOD which we had to prove here. Also we have the second part of the theorem in which we have to prove that angle AOD is equal to angle BOC. This also can be proved in a similar manner. Angle AOD and angle DOB form a linear pair. Also angle DOB and angle BOC form a linear pair. This implies angle AOD plus angle DOB is equal to 180 degrees and angle DOB plus angle BOC is equal to 180 degrees just as we did in the first part. This implies angle AOD plus angle DOB is equal to angle DOB 
plus angle BOC. Now we can cancel angle DOB on both sides. So this will imply angle AOD is equal to angle BOC. So angle AOD is equal to BOC is our second part. So what we have done in this theorem is we've identified two sets of linear pairs in which one of the angles is common. We equated the sum of angles and the common angle got cancelled. After cancelling, vertically opposite angles became equal. I hope you followed the approach used in the proof and how the concept of linear pairs was used for proving vertically opposite angles as equal.